Hi everybody, it's Julia, your trusted travel expert from Mathis and Travel, helping you find that je ne sais quoi wherever you are in the world. And I wanted to do a quick sort of 2016 year in review, because I know in a lot of respects it's not really been the best of years. We've lost a lot of beloved artists, um, we had the election, uh, there's, you know, continuing violence and terrorism, you know, kind of both home and abroad. It's just sort of been a rough year. But actually for me personally, and for Mathis and Travel, it's been a really great year. And, you know, I wanted to sort of highlight some of those things, you know, between uh, getting to experience the Caribbean um, for real as an adult a little bit in the spring and the fall, um, you know, to getting some really great certifications like in New Orleans and also in the Alps that I just came back from um, that was for Talc Tours and for Club Med, both of which are amazing companies uh, with amazing travel products that I, you know, love to celebrate with people to this summer where I had two amazing weeks in Italy followed by two amazing weeks in Croatia and Slovenia and I mean those two trips were just spectacular you know for in Italy for example for the first time I finally got to go to Milan and the Lake District and you know Verona which was such a great surprise and had lots of deliciousness in Bologna um, so that was all really good and then obviously experiencing Croatia finally for the first time I got to go to Plitvice Lakes which was amazing waterfall national park there. I got to see Lipizzaner stallions horses in Slovenia uh, as well as Lake Bled there and then you know the Dalmatian coast. I mean it was just super super dreamy and I know anybody would have a fantastic time in either of those uh, three countries either uh, any one of the three of them. Uh, so I would you know super would love to help plan trips there. I had some amazing client trips that I planned for people. Um, from just recently, I had some clients take a Christmas markets cruise through Germany, which is just, so many people did it this, this winter. It's really making me want to try it next winter. I have, you know, obviously I've talked a lot about the couple doing a honeymoon extravaganza in Southeast Asia. That's been really fun to plan and it's really inspired me to go back to Asia myself. Um, you know, I had lots of lots of clients go to Spain this year, everything from wine tasting, private, you know, kind of special uh, custom tours to family bonding tours, you know, some people in France and just all over. And it's just been a really fun year. It's also been a transitional year, obviously, because I started off in San Francisco and about halfway through the year moved back home. Um, I've got some some new look, um, uh, new branding coming along that uh, I'm really excited about. It's going to be a bit of a change from Mathis and Travel, but uh, more authentic, more me. So I'm really excited about that coming up next year. Um, and with the the move, uh, what I've realized is, you know, as much as I love to travel, and obviously I do, I love to go explore the world. But then when I come home. I really, I really decided that my little hometown of Hickory, North Carolina is my like safe port, home port in the storm, as you could call it. Um, and I've actually, as I speak to you, I'm in the process of purchasing a house in little Hickory, North Carolina. So there's lots of exciting stuff coming up for 2017 in my life. Uh, I mean, you know, like I said, planning all these trips for my clients really just shows me all the different places I still haven't explored and I've been a lot of places and so there's so many new places that I'm looking forward to going to next year but I am going back to some old favorites um, London and Paris namely which will be really fun and I just want to kind of get your juices flowing um, you know where are you thinking about going next year what bucket list you know items do you want to check off um, next year and just think about it and uh, you know enjoy this time with your loved ones, and uh, I will see you in 2017. Bye.